uh, pregame media responsibilities from Ty Lue, which I know Ty was super upset about. As we get this one underway, Bulls win the tap. They'll have to start the fourth quarter as well. Now, Car Caruso is a sailboat, and Kawhi Leonard is a full-on taker. In the three-point shooting for Chicago, they had 16 threes against the Golden State Warriors, but they ranked just 22nd in the league in overall efficiency. Bottom seven, the rebound belongs to Chicago. White. White's not hesitating to pull the trigger on the three-point shot. And PG would love to have that one back one more time, that wide open. Zou down the lane, and down the hatch it goes. Second bucket for Avita Zubat. And a teeter-totter start to this one. We saw James Harden really upset with himself. Yeah, he got posted up by the big man, but he normally swipes that ball out of their hands before they can get up with it. He just missed that last one. Terrence Mann for three. He normally swipes that ball out of their hands before they can get up with it. He just missed that last one. Terrence Mann for three. He made all five of his shots against the Houston Rockets, including three threes. Vucevic backing down on Zoo. Harden flirting with a double team. Vucevic spins away, puts it up, but not in. Vucevic coming off a Sumu with five of the ten for Chicago. Harden for three. And Zoo in a sea of red comes away with a loose ball. George, rhythm dribble for three. It's good for Paul George. Their team really lighting it up. Clippers just four for 13. Bulls five for 13. Man, baseline drive. Disappearing from any thoughts of the playoff picture, yet they keep fighting back, fighting back, and there is another offensive foul for setting a score. Leaky guy. 39-32. Clippers down by seven. Dosumu blocked off the backboard by Zoo, recovered by Craig. Misses and Harden has the loose ball inside to Zoo. Juggles has to bring it back outside for Norman Powell. Powell inside or whistle and a foul go to the line. And again, believe it or not, another back-to-back -back for the Clippers. They'll be in New Orleans the night after. Harden comes away with a rebound after the long two by DeRozan. Ahead to Zoo! Look what the Clippers play on, on daylight savings time. That's it's bogus. 45-39, Clippers trail by six. DeRozan inside, counted at a foul. Zoo inside pivot on his defender and lays it in. Zoo now with six points and six rebounds. Clippers get a fresh 14. George to Zoo, rolling well and throws it down. Great play out of bounds. Chicago 10 of 21 from the three point line. George, by the way, five assists for the Clippers. He controls right now. 7.20 to play in the third. George. In every single offseason, he said, I start all my workouts with finishing, watching film to try and find ways to get better. And uh, Evita Zubats has taken notes, Christina. He flushes it down. He flushes it down. Clippers now cut the lead down to two. They were trailing by 14 just moments ago. Now the, a chance to time maybe take. Pardon Lobs it again to Zoo. Oh, he makes the grab and flushes it in again. 12 for Zoo. Third quarter for the Clippers. If they freeze Rusevich, then Zoo rolling to the basket's going to be wide open. And they keep attacking Zoo, attacking Zoo. Ty Lue, yeah, this squad really rolling with 4.07 to play in the third. Cardinal. Chase Bondo Sumu lobs it again to Zoo. Under four to play in the fourth. White catch and shoot three. Zoo with the rebound. You, anonymous people in the organization, but boy, they're the lifeblood for coaching. Credit to all video coordinators across the league. Clippers have one of the best. Zoo is fouled inside, 242 to play. He's making Zoo go to the line and prove that he can make two. Uh, a different looking Evita Zubac, that is for sure. At least in the second half, he did struggle a bit. And the Clippers do have two timeouts as well, but we'll see. Clippers are out in front by 10. It's been good to see Zoo return to form here in this second half. In 2011, the Clippers were under 500. They've been over 500 ever since. It is a big deal. Times have changed for the Clippers, there's no doubt about it. But bigger fish to fry. A nice comeback win today for the Clippers.